Hi there, and let's troubleshoot vCloud Usage Insight for automatic reporting. Normally every month, the partner logs in to their business portal and sees their monthly report. But if that monthly report is not there, we need to see which usage meters haven't sent data. So let's go to console.cloud.vmware.com and log into the service. Once we're in the service, you should be able to see the list of usage meters that you have registered in the service and mapped to your contracts. Now the first bit of troubleshooting is to go to preferences and check to make sure you've provided consent for the data from usage meter to be used for automatic reporting. The first is for the data for automatic reporting and the second is for end user reporting. Next, let's make sure that trial mode is turned off. When it's turned on, none of the automatic reporting will work. Now check to make sure that all of the usage meters that you run running your environment in production are on this list. If they're not, let's make sure to register the remaining usage meters. Click register new. And on this page, you only need two pieces of information, a friendly name and the instance ID of the usage meter. How to get the instance ID can be found by clicking on the little information tab on the right. For usage meter 3.6, you'll need to go into the virtual appliance and generate a report. Download the report and on line two, you'll see the UM instance ID. Make sure to only grab the instance ID and not pound UM colon. On usage meter 4.0 and onward, you can see this information on the UI. Next, we need to make sure that the usage meter is assigned to the correct contract and that we set it to the right mode. Production is if you're gonna use it for automatic reporting and test would usually be when you're staging a new usage meter before you're gonna bring it into production. If you're using usage meter 4.0, make sure to set the flag appropriately. Back on the main page, we can check to make sure that a registered usage meter is able to communicate with VMware by hovering over the status icon. In this case, it's a red circle with an exclamation mark because VMware has yet to receive any data from the usage meter. To check the usage meter's connectivity, we can go into the usage meter appliance and on the manage page, email settings, check the SMTP server to make sure everything is set up correctly. You can send yourself an email to make sure that everything is working correctly. Don't forget that usage meter also uses HTTPS port 443 to send data to VMware to ums.cloud.vmware.com. Now let's go to the automatic reporting page and send last month's report so we can test that connectivity. In the top right corner, click automatic reporting and on that page, click submit now. This will send last month's report to VMware so we can make sure that everything's working correctly. Back on Usage Insight, you should see your usage meter within 15 to 30 minutes go from a red circle with an exclamation mark to a green circle with a check mark. The tool tag also tells you if the report was used for automatic reporting. Back in the business portal, make sure that we troubleshoot this within the first 72 hours of the month so that we can make sure the automatic reporting works from start to finish. If we don't do it within 72 hours, the report will become available to you, but you'll have to go back to manual reporting and aggregation of the usage for the month. That's it. If you have any further questions or issues, please reach out to GSS VMware support team.